Uh, now it's just it's about to get better and better. So let me introduce y'all to my swim bait collection. Now, as you notice, if you know swim baits very well, you'll notice that uh, most of these spros right here, that's twenty dollars each. And you know, as you can tell, I have several of them. But I've gone crazy about these. This is the Seville Magic Swimmer, and uh, it swims just like a blue bait, but they got them in different colors. And I have been killing them here lately on these Sabil Magic Swimmers. Uh, the Spro BBZ1 uh, 4 inch shad works, you know, pretty good. This is the floating sexy lavender version. And uh, I, I, I've gone crazy about these things. Uh, the best swim bait that I've used so far would be this, uh, you know, Reaction Strike Revolution uh, Sunfish. Now, uh, the reason why I like this the most because it actually resembles the swimming fish a little bit better and the tail doesn't sway left and right um, as, f as far as it does uh, as those uh, BBZ1 swim baits. But, uh, you know, this early spring, so yes, these uh, swim baits are the best things to use. This is my crankbait box, by the way. Uh, as you can tell, I'm crazy about my Rapala Shad Wraps, number fives. The Strike King Sexy Lavender and the Chartreuse um, Rapala Glass Wrap that I that I have, uh, and uh, I'm getting into these Bomber Fat Free Shad. Probably the best thing that I've used. I caught more fish on those just as much as I have on these uh, Rapala Shad Wraps. So uh, it's a good thing that I like. So you know, if you're into crankbait fishing and everything, I would advise you to get some of these.